Hi everyone, I'm Gail, and this 10 minute morning yoga flow is focusing on balance. So actually in order to have balance, we need strong glutes as well as proprioception of the placement of our feet, being able to like twist our body as like a unit rather than just throwing our arm back and all kinds of juicy little things like that. So we're gonna see what we can accomplish in 10 minutes and see how you feel. So let's start by closing our eyes, tuning into the breath, letting your shoulders relax, and let your spine feel tall and upright. And see if you can feel all that internal movement pulsing outward and upward on the inhale and drawing inward and downward on the exhale. Keeping that sensation of the breath, let's come onto our hands and knees and tabletop. And just begin to move every place in your body that will move. So shoulders, hips, ribs, spine. And notice how that effect just trickles down into your hands and feet, up through your neck and out into the crown of your head. So now come into more of a neutral position, hover your left knee off the floor. And first, without lifting the hips, you can just externally rotate and open that left knee out to the side, left leg out to the side. Inhale to lift, exhale to lower one more time. And now we'll lift the hip up so it'll open up even higher. Inhale to open and lift, exhale to lower. Inhale, open to lift, exhale, lower. Inhale, open, exhale, lower. One more time, inhale, open, exhale, lower. And straighten your leg. See if you can internally rotate the left inner thigh so that your foot turns a little bit to the right. And then big external rotation so your toes point out to the left. And just go back and forth without using any momentum, just feeling the energy in your hips, in your abs, in your back. Go ahead and come back into tabletop. And we'll do the same thing with the other side. So first hover your right knee off the floor and then without lifting your hip, just open your knee out to the side. We'll do that five times. So inhale out, exhale lower. Inhale out, exhale lower. Inhale out, exhale lower. One more time, inhale out, exhale lower. And this time we'll lift the hip. So you get more movement. And one more time. And come back to center. Straighten out that right leg. First do a little internal rotation. So the toes point slightly to the left. And then external rotation, toes out to the right. And just go back and forth. A couple more times. Creating almost a sense of stillness, but feeling the hips working, the glutes working. Nice, lower down, tuck your toes, lift your hips up and back, stretch back to down dog. On your next inhale, sweep your left leg up. And on your exhale, pull your knee into your chest, keep your back rounded, step your foot forward, lower the right knee down, twist to your left. And see if you can really get into those obliques. So you're hugging the glutes over to the right and twisting your rib cage over to the left, reach your left arm up. Now see if you can keep that twist, come on back up, bring the hands together and bring your elbow to the outside of your knee and really get into those obliques, twisting as far as you can to the side. Then we're gonna look down, separate our hands, bring the right hand forward, step into the left foot, twisting to your left for revolved half moon. So if you can get really light on those fingertips, so you're strong in the top leg, light in the fingertips, and maybe you could even lift your fingers off the ground. Good, square the hips, step back, downward facing dog. 
Inhale, reach the right leg up. Exhale, step it all the way forward. Lower the back knee down, twist to the right. Reach your arms up, bring the hands together in front of your heart. Keep twisting to the right, lowering your left elbow to the outside of your right knee. Prayer twist, open up. Then look down, see if you can keep the twist, separate your hands and step up into revolved half moon. Keep working the, the obliques to find that twist deep inside. Maybe you can hover your fingers off the floor, even if it's just for a second. Good, and step back, downward facing dog. Lower your hands and knees down, coming into tabletop. Bring your right hand out to the right a little bit. Stretch your left leg so your toes touch the ground and reach your left arm up and over. And then on an exhale, pull your elbow back and your knee forward. Inhale, open up. Exhale, hug it in. Maybe even stretch your arm back. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, hug in. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, hug in. One more time, inhale, reach up. Exhale, hug in, and come back into your tabletop. Bring your left hand out to the left a little bit. Stretch your right leg out, toes touching the ground. Reach your right arm up and over. Find a big stretch here. And then on your exhale, pull your right knee forward. Reach your right arm back. Inhale forward. Exhale, reach. Inhale forward. Exhale, reach. Inhale, forward and back. Exhale, hug in. One more time. Inhale, forward and back. Exhale, hug in. Come on back into your tabletop. Tuck your toes. Stretch back. Down dog. Come up onto your toes. Walk your feet forward to your hands. Come up onto your fingertips. Then roll to the outside edges of your feet. Roll back to the inside edges. Back and forth a couple of times. Come back to center. Lift your the whole front of your foot up, pulling your toes towards your shins. And with the toes spreading lower down, lift the heels up. And just lift and lower. Now we're gonna play with going from half moon to revolved half moon. So you can use a block also if you have a yoga block that can be helpful. So bring your right hand a little bit forward, a little bit out to the side. Reach your left leg up, open up through the shoulders, reach your arm up, reach your leg up nice and strong. Then lower your hand down, square your hips, lift the ribs and twist over to your right. Lower your right hand down. Half moon to the left. Lower your left hand down. Half moon to the right. Lower your right hand down. Half moon to the left. Lower your left hand down. Half moon to the right. Lower your right hand down. Half moon to the left again. And then we'll play with a little balance. See if we can do like prayer position in front of our heart. So bring your left hand down, really push into your right foot, squeeze the right glutes, and then see if you can bring your right hand up. Nice and release, lower down. Kind of wiggle out your hips a little bit. And then we'll try the same thing on the other side. So bring your left hand out to the side a little bit, a little bit forward of your foot. Lift your right leg up. Stack your hips, reach your arms up. Remember to keep that top leg super strong and lifted. And lower your hand down, square the hips, squeeze the inner thighs, rotate strongly from your abs, from your core. Keep reaching out through that top leg and then lower down. Open up, half moon to the right. And then lower your right hand down, squeeze those inner thighs, twist deeply as much as you can, like there's this inner squeeze. And also radiating out. We'll come back to half moon on the right. And lower your right hand down and twist. 
to your left, coming into revolved half moon on your left. Good, and now we'll come back into half moon, facing, twisting to the right. We'll try that balance without our hands. So maybe bring your right hand to the center of your chest and then slowly pull the left hand up. Find a little balance and release your hands. Lower your leg down. Come on into a squat. Lower your hips down. And just let's do a little bit of gentle rocking from side to side. And come to a comfortable seat and just a little side stretch from side to side. And come back to center. Bring your hands together in front of your heart. Thank you so much for joining me in this practice. I hope that you feel energized and alive and maybe a sense of greater balance, not only physically, but mentally. Um, please leave a comment if you like this video, subscribe. Please share it with your friends. That's really important to spread the word. Let everyone come into a little more balance. And I look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye.